Hi there, Katie and Tim here with another episode of EDU in 90. Today, we're talking about an exciting new update to Google Expeditions, Augmented Reality. For the past few years, Google Expeditions has enabled students to go on virtual field trips and to tour far off places via the power of virtual reality, or VR. Now, Expeditions AR brings objects from across time and space straight into the classroom. AR stands for Augmented Reality. And this means that through the lens of your tablet or smartphone, you can place digital objects into the real space right in front of you. This technology can bring abstract concepts like a tiny strand of DNA or a whirling tornado to life. Let's take a look. Expeditions AR enables teachers to bring fossils, Renaissance art, the human brain, and more directly into the classroom in a three-dimensional form that students can interact with and learn from. Google Arts and Culture worked with the expert organizations like Smithsonian, Smart History, and Oxford University Press, and through those partnerships, created more than 100 new AR tours for students and teachers to explore. Here are a few of the things to keep in mind as you're bringing Expeditions AR into your classroom. First, there are tons of AR objects to explore with your students. The Expeditions app is already packed with over 100 available tours, and each of these includes several objects. That's over 600 objects that are ready to be explored. Tour the ocean floor to see plate tectonics, seaweed, and stingrays. Or even tour the space race with objects like Sputnik, spacesuits, Telstar communication satellite, and Apollo 11. We've heard from you that it's important for classroom tools to offer options to provide some extra guidance. We've taken that to heart with Expeditions AR. For a guided experience, teachers can print off markers on which the objects will rest. These can be found in the hamburger menu in the app, by selecting Help with Markers. Teachers can also use the Spotlight feature to shine an augmented light on specific aspects and direct students' attention to certain aspects of an object. Next, we know that each lesson is unique, so we've made objects resizable so that they can meet these needs. That way, you're able to get a close-up look at a cell undergoing mitosis or shrink an erupting volcano to fit on your desk. Your students may also enjoy seeing a life-size African elephant within the walls of their classroom. It's also important to note that tours can be saved for future visits, and students can also tour on their own for additional learning outside of the school day. Ready to get started? Expeditions AR tours are available to anyone via the Google Expeditions app with a compatible Android or iOS device. Alternatively, schools can order a kit with everything you need. This video's description has more information on compatibility and kits. That does it for this episode. Be sure to subscribe to the Google for Education YouTube channel, and we'll see you next time. Want to streamline the feedback process with your students? Check out our last episode to learn more about new grading functionality in Google Classroom.